Hi guys, welcome back to another video on my channel. Hello everybody, welcome back to another video on my channel. For today's video, we're going to be doing something that is so highly requested that... And I'm sweating already and it's like literally been maybe five minutes of filming, but today we're going to be doing my updated album collection. Now I just counted and I'm pretty sure I have 147 albums. I'm not exactly sure though because I probably missed one or two because I think I had more than that when I counted last time, but I did give a couple away to my cousin so maybe that's it, but I didn't give her, like, I gave her like three albums, so I don't know. I probably just miscounted, but um, I just want to show you guys the situation around me right now. To put it lightly, I'm surrounded by albums, but yes, I'm going to go through all of the albums that I own, tell you each album, show it to you, not do, do flip throughs or anything, but I'm just going to go through one by one. So I kind of split it up by group, but I thought we'd go with like least amount to biggest amount kind of ishy thing, I don't know. We're just going to go through what I pull, but uh, yes, we're going to start off with groups that I don't have a lot of. So the first group is GOT7, this is their um, album Spinning Top, this is their mini album, I don't know, like, I think it's like they're like 7th or 8th, I don't know. But yes, I got this um, because of my K-pop and my subscribers choose my K-pop poll and I really do enjoy this album. This is the security version. Yes, I only have one GOT7 album. Then I also have New East's Happily Ever After the mini album thing. This is the green version. I only have one copy. Um, this is my favorite photo book, so I decided to buy this one. And yes, I thoroughly, thoroughly enjoy this one. The next group we have is TXT. This is their debut mini album, The Dream Chapter Star. It is upside down. Great job, Ariel. Um, I thoroughly enjoy this album. It was such a great debut. I can't wait to collect more of their albums when they come out with more, but for now, just got this one and I'm happy with it. The next group that I have only one is One Team. This is their first mini debut Hello Just One Team. Um, really, really loved Vibe. Literally love this. So obsessed with it. I'm not as obsessed with rolling, 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 rolling. Um, I don't know if I'm going to purchase that album just yet, but I will get back to you guys, I guess. But yeah, got this one. And then my last group that I only have one album, or no, I have one more. I lied. Um, then we have Pentagon. This is Positive Pentagon. This is literally my favorite Pentagon album to exist. I do adore Pentagon and they are definitely on my bias list, but I just do not want to collect their albums. For most of these groups, I don't want to collect their albums. I like got seven. I do not want to. And uh, New East, I don't want to, but I just bought one album of like choice. I don't know. I just really enjoyed it. But yes, love this album. And then the last group that I have just, yes, the last group that I have just one album is um, Idol, this is their debut L mini album, I Am. I do want to buy, um, I Made, but I just haven't gotten around to it, and, like, where I am, it's really expensive, so I'm just like, uh, I'll do it eventually, but yes, love this album, love them. The next couple of groups are groups that I only collect a few albums, or I only have a few albums for, so, um, the first group is AB6, now, they only have one al mini album out, but I only have two copies of it. This is the Be Complete, this is the white version and the red version. Love this mini album, so obsessed with them, literally loved their debut. I will be purchasing the black version, but I just haven't done it yet, so. The next group is SF9, the first album that I have is Sensuous, this is their fifth mini album, it's on it, great. Um, for SF9, I have a little rule for myself, I only buy one version per album, so I bought this one because um, I got it at KCON and it was half off, so I was like, eh. um, The next album, I think is this is their sixth mini. Yes, this is their sixth mini, uh, Narcissus. I love this, I am so obsessed, so obsessed with Enough, so good. Um, and yes, I got this version, this one was kindly bought by my friend when she went to Korea, so that just kind of just makes it more special. Um, and then the last SF9 album I have um, that I've collected so far is RPM. This is their newest, I think this is their seventh mini. Yes, it is their seventh mini. So I have five, six, and seven. I still need to buy one, two, three, four. Um, but yes, I really love this and I got this version. This is the max version. The next group that I have, just a little tiny, tiny collection, is Astro. You guys know I literally love Astro. I am so obsessed with them. I just love them, but I just haven't collected a lot of their albums yet. So the first one I have is Dream Part 1. This is their fourth mini album. Love this. Baby is such a good song. Literally, guys, if you don't stand Astro, I totally, totally, totally suggest. Um, the next one that I have is Rise Up. This is... A special mini album they did. I don't really know what it was. I'm trying to do these kind of in chronological order, but I'm probably gonna miss a lot of this. Uh, uh, but yes, love this album. And then the next, last two I have are All Light. This is their first album. 
thing. Mine are in such bad condition. I've literally beat them up so much. Like, I am so sorry. Cause I have both the green version and the white version. I think they have other names, but that's just what I call them. So, yes, I have these two. Um, and then the next... Who's next? I'm going to continue with groups that I don't collect all of their albums just because uh, I have groups that I collect everything. So the next one is The Boys. So we're going to start off with their first mini, The First. Um, so with The Boys, it's similar to my SF9 collection where I only collect one album per... One copy, like one version per album. So this is the first, this is this version. I don't know what it's called. Don't even ask me, I don't know. Um, and then for the start, we have two copies of the same version because if you guys haven't heard my spiel, these are really severely damaged. So Amazon sent me two because I bought them on Amazon. Uh, both came damaged though, but I gotta keep both photo cards, so who's complaining about me? Then I have The Sphere, which is their first um, single album. This is one of the versions. Then I have The Only, which is their third mini album. And then I have Bloom Bloom, which is their second single album. Yes, so obsessed with the boys, literally love them. Gonna put these over here though because everything's falling. Next group we have is ATs. Now for ATs, I do collect all of their albums. They only have three mini albums thus far. So yes, the first one we have is their first mini, which is episode one, all to zero. The next one is their second, that's the wrong one. The second mini, um, episode two, zero to one. And then I have both versions of the third mini. <laughs> One to all, they're both upside down. This is the wave version and the illusion version, so I have both of them. The next group is Blackpink. I do plan to collect all of Blackpink's albums, but I'm just not there yet. So the first one is Square Up. We have the pink version and we have the black version. Um, and then I have one copy of Kill This Love. This is the pink version. I do plan on getting the other one, but I just haven't done it yet. And then I also have Jenny's solo um, album. So let's do uh, Stray Kids next. So for Stray Kids, I have all of their albums that they've ever released. So the first one they have is Mixtape. Um, the next one was I Am Not. I have both versions. I have the I Am and the Not version. I don't know if that's actually correct, but that's what I'm going to say. Then I also have I Am Who. I have the I Am and the Who version. And then the next one is I Am You. I have the I Am and the You version. Probably mix those up again, sorry. And then I have Clay One Mido, so I have the Clay One version, the Mido version, and then I also have the limited edition version. And then I also have their Clay Two Yellow Wood, so we have the Clay Two version, the Yellow Wood version, and then I have two copies of the limited edition version, just because I do. I don't know. Okay, next we're gonna go into 101, so I have all of 101's albums so we have their first mini to be one to be one sure um i have this pink in the sky version and then i have their second mini nothing without you we have the wanna and the one version and then we have their third mini i promise you so i have the day and the night version <laughs> and then i have their fourth mini Fourth mini, nothing without you. Um, there are six versions to this, and I have all of them. Whoops. So we have this is the art book version, the <laughs> number one version, the heel version, the lean on me version, the triple position version, and the one on one version. So there's six different versions and I do own all of them. I don't regret it. Um, and then we have their first and last mini uh, full album, The Power of Destiny, and we have the Adventure and Romance version, Adventure, Romance, Romance, I don't know. We have both of them. <laughs> Another group that I don't have completely collected is Seventeen. So let me show you all my Seventeen albums. Going in order of what I have, the first one I have is Going Seventeen. This is the Make the Seventeen version. Love this. I do want to collect all of Seventeen albums, but I'm just lazy right now. Um, we also have, this is AL1. This is the Alone version. Um, we have Director's Cut. This is the Sunset version. And then I have three copies of Teenage as of right now. So I have the white version, the RS version, and the green version. Love this album. Love this. And then for You Make My Day and You Made My Dawn, we have 
I only have one version of You Make My Day, but it's I have two copies of the same version because my dumb self was like, oh, if I buy one on Amazon that says random cover, I definitely won't get the one that I already have. Uh, I did, so now I have two, ver two copies of the follow version, which I don't really care like at all in the slightest. I just need to collect the other two um, as well. And then for You Made My Dawn, I have a complete set. So I have the Before Dawn version, the Dawn version, and the Eternal Sunshine version. Then for the next group, we have Red Velvet. So for Red Velvet, I do plan on collecting all of their albums. I just don't have all of them yet. I'm missing two albums, which I will mention, and then I don't collect all covers of all albums because when they do each member cover, I only collect Irene. So yes, I'll go into that in a second. But I have the first mini ice cream cake. This is the ice cream cake version and the automatic version. Then I have the velvet i don't know if i'm doing this in order uh, i'm sorry and we have russian roulette and then we have rookie this is irene's cover literally a goddess um and then we have red summer and we have the perfect velvet peekaboo oh, that's not the cover peekaboo the perfect velvet uh bad boy i'm missing the red and then I have the limited edition of Summer Magic. It's just the sleeve because the other part's over there and I don't feel like showing it to you. Um, I'm missing the regular edition of Summer Magic. So those are two. I'm missing the red and the regular edition of Summer Magic. And then we have RBB. And then we have the Reve Festival. This is the day one version. And then this is the limited Irene version. So yeah. That's my Red Velvet collection. Um, I Like I said, I'm only missing two. Um, and yeah, I'm pretty pretty happy about it. So now we're gonna go into NCT. So we're gonna start off with NCT 2018. So I have the Empathy album. I have the Dream and the Reality version. For NCT Dream, I have uh, the first single album, The First. We have the second mini, We Yell. And then the third mini, We Go Up. And then I do have both versions, both copies of Boom, We Boom on the way. Yes, I have both of those on the way. And then for NCT 127, we have, this is their first mini NCT 127. I have the sleeve, but I have put it in my photo card binder. We have this mini Limitless. I only have one copy of this because she's ugly. I'm sorry. Um, and then we have their first album, regular and regular. I have both the regular and the regular version. Oh, I missed this one. We have uh, one of their first minis. This is Cherry Bomb. And then we have, I have one, this is my only Japanese album in my entire collection, and this is um, Chain, this is Jaehyun's version, because Jaehyun's my bias. And then we have uh, We Are Superhuman, this is their fourth mini album, I believe. And then let me get into all of my Regulate albums, because that's going to take a second, so let me put this stuff away. So I right now have seven copies of Regulate. I'm missing Win Win, Doyoung, and Johnny. So we have, this is Taeyong's copy. This is Tail's copy. This is Yuta's copy. This is Jae Young's copy. Jae Hyun's copy. This is Jung Woo's copy. This is Mark. And this is Haytan. So yes, all of those photo books are the same, by the way, which is why I hate SM so much. That's why I never give in to what SM does member copies. But when I bought that for the first, like, the first time I went to purchase that album, I bought four. And when you buy four, you're already almost halfway to ten, so you're like, screw it, I'll just buy all ten. And now I'm at seven, and I'm like, I don't even want to buy the other ones. Of course I want them, but like... <sighs> it's fine. I'll, I'm gonna buy them eventually, but it's just gonna hurt. So yeah And now we're going to be getting on to the last two groups, which is BTS and EXO um, I definitely say BTS is my biggest collection, but I do have quite a few EXO albums So first we're gonna go into EXO CDX. Um, I only have three right now I have Chen's version of Hey Mama, which is similar. I've literally always had this um, I don't have the other two copies of Hey Mama, so I need them But I do have both copies of Blooming Days now, so I have the Blooming and the Days version Blooming and Days I don't even know to go along with that, I do have, not really go along with it, but I do have both copies of Baekhyun's um, debut mini City Lights. I have the both versions. I don't know if there's specific versions of this, but I just got these in the mail, so it's super, super exciting. Um, I do plan on collecting XOSC as well, but I only bought one version of their album because I'm broke right now. 
you guys can't tell why. Like, there's, yeah. Um, so for EXO, we have, this is Let Me Write. This is, like, the most old album I have of EXO. I don't have a full EXO collection. I do plan on collecting all of EXO's albums, minus when they do member covers. I'm only going to buy back on, except for one exception. So I haven't done it. And I'm also only collecting Korean albums. I'm not collecting um, Chinese albums. So this is Let Me Write. All of these are Korean, by the way. Uh, so this is Let Me Write. We have Sing For You. This is Schumann's cover because I bought this random and I got Schumann's and I'm just going to keep it, but I'm also going to buy my Kyun's. Um, we have Exodus. This is uh, Baek Hyun's cover. We have EXO K's Overdose. So this is the Korean version. And then we go into all the new EXO albums that I have. So let me move these a second. So we have... These are like three older albums, so we have one copy of The War. I think this is the A version. Um, we have Universe, which is such a good album, and then we have Lotto. Um, I do, like I said, need a lot more EXO albums, but now we're going to get into the more recent version copying albums. So the first one we have is, this is Don't Mess Up My Tempo. This is the Allegro, Moderato, or... Viva no, on that version. I don't know which one. Hopefully I can put it up on the screen and if not, it's, it's one of them. So I have all three of them. So I have this one and then I have this one and then I have this one and then I also have the limited edition uh, Vivace version which has your boy, your boy, your boy Yixing. Yeah, uh, I had to buy that of course. Oh, I put inside of them what they're, what they're called. Ariel, wow. Okay, so this is the Moderato version, the Andante version, and this is the Allegro version. Wow, Ariel really coming in clutch. I don't even remember, I don't remember doing that. Wow, wow. Sometimes I surprise myself. Um, and then I do have both copies of Love Shot. We have the Love and the Shot, or the Love and the Shot, I don't even remember, but we have both copies of Love Shot. Yay. <laughs> so now we're going to be getting into my biggest collection that I have because it is BTS. I have a full BTS collection. <sighs> Let's get into it. <laughs> um, I want to do this in like order, but I don't know if I can. So let's see. So the first one we have is their first mini, Too Cool for School. Then I have their second mini, School Love Affair. Um, I don't remember what came first, but this is Oh Are You Late Too. I think this is their third mini and then... This is their fourth mini. I honestly don't remember, but this is Dark and Wild. I think then we go into You Never Walk Alone. So I have the pink and the mint version. If I do any of this out of order, it's not that I'm a fake fan. It's that I literally just can't think right now because there's too many things around me. Please just... Uh, yeah. <laughs> um, and then we have... So we have both copies of Young Forever. This is the day and the night version. And then we go into HYBH Part 1. So this is Part 1, both versions pink in the sky version and then part two we have both versions again pink and blue sky whatever um and then we have your sister wings we have the w i the n and the g version each of these is a little bit different because each has a different member so jin has his own photo book i think namjoon and chungu jimin and yoongi and then Tay and Hobie. So yes, love this. Um, obsessed. <laughs> and then we go into Love Yourself. So so now we go into the Love Yourself series. So we have Love. This is L O V E. This is Love Yourself. Her. And I also have an extra E version. I think I think that's the only extra I have. This is the E version. And then we go into Love Yourself tier. So we have Y O U R. And then we have Love Yourself Answer, so I have S-E-L-F. And then I also have an extra F version. And then we go into the Map of the Soul Persona. So I have version like this, one, two, three, and four. And then I also have two copies. Um, I have an extra one and an extra two. And then for BTS, I also have the BTS World OST, which just came out recently. And then this is just something I had on my shelf, but this is the BTS... Love Yourself Tour World DVD Soul thing. And then I also have, um, I forgot to show you. This is NCT's uh, 2019 season screening. It's not an album, but I have it, so yes. But yes, that was my entire album collection. Like I said earlier, I have 147 something albums. 
I don't even know. I, I'm very fortunate to say that I have all these albums. Most of these albums were purchased with my own money. Um, some of them were gifts from family, but like I said, most of them were purchased with my own money. You guys can check out any of my hauls and unboxings. You'll see that I literally spend all my money. All my coin goes into this. Um, and it's something that makes me really happy. I really enjoy collecting. I love photo card collecting. I think it's so much fun. And yeah, it just I love to see my collection grow. Um, I definitely will continue to collect more albums. So I hope you guys stay tuned with my channel and continue to see my album collection grow. Because if you guys were here since... September of last year when I moved to college. Um, I think I brought 20 albums with me So now I have over 140 and it's crazy to me um, And yeah, I'm really excited to go to Korea because I'm going to be studying abroad in Korea and I get to collect even more so I'm super super excited. So stay tuned for more um, Collection updates where you get to see my collection grow and yes, I Love you guys so so much. Thank you for all of the constant love and support Stay up to date with all of my channel and all of that stuff. If you guys are interested, I will, I kind of am interested in doing a light stick collection. So if you guys want to see what light sticks I have, please let me know in the comments down below. Don't forget to thumbs up this video. And yes, I love you guys and I'll talk to you guys very soon.